Today, I'm going to be going down a line that you've already gone down on the channel, but I am still yet to. I am going to finally go to three stations along the Chat Hill line, Acklington, Woodrington, and Pegswood. So our journey on this line doesn't really start until Morpeth, but we're starting in Durham Station because we're hoping to get the Pride train to Morpeth. So it'll be cool to finally get to ride on the LNR Pride. I've You've been, been meaning to so get that long. train for so long, it's haven't you? It's been avoiding you? me, literally. Yeah. <laughs> so you're finally getting your wish answered. I you hope. get the LNR Pride <laughs> train. As long as it's not been set swapped, that'd be very nice. Oh, brilliant. <laughs> Looking so good, finally. So we are going to be on this train directly to Morpeth, thankfully. No uh, changing at Newcastle that I was expecting we'd have to do, but no, we've got lucky with this service. So these stations are served by a twice a day northern service, which funnily enough runs along the East Coast Main Line, which I guess that's why they, they, they don't run that often because it's a stopper and, you know, obviously it's going to, you know, hold up the faster trains. Now we have both been to Chat Hill before, but we have a plan for us to visit the other three stations, which involves going uh, up one and then taking a bus to the other and then coming yeah. back. It's a bit complicated. We'll explain it more on the way. Yeah, I'm sure we will. Oh, we're getting a Jamie cameo. Nice. Hello. How you doing? <laughs> nice to see you again. So let's go ahead and get to Morpeth. So now we need to walk from here to Morpeth bus station where we can get a bus to Peg's Wood. I didn't know there was a way out here. Huh. Nice. Very cool. It's very pretty. Now you've visited these stations before. You already know the yeah. way to the bus station, don't you? So, I, so. I, I did this before with Will and someone else. But I mean, last time when me and Will were walking between Morpeth station and bus station, the last three buses had been cancelled. Yeah. <laughs> and it was going to be packed for the next one. Luckily, the next one showed up and we just made it to Pegswood in time, but... I hope that doesn't happen <laughs> yeah. this time. Yeah, I hope it shows that up. That would be nice to have it a bit more stress-free. All right, here we are at the bus station. Brilliant. Rather annoyingly, we just missed the uh, previous bus, which was at uh, 14 past the hour and on Saturdays, the day we're doing this, it's every half an hour. God. Although it's not actually that big a deal because the one after was the one we were hoping to get anyway. Getting the other one would have just been a nice bonus, I guess. We would have had like half an hour extra at Pegswood, I guess. Okay, so the 35 bus that we're getting goes between Morpeth and Woodhorn, uh, which actually goes through Ashington. So if, it, if you guys don't know, the, there's an Ashington line uh, opening up, hopefully, hopefully soon, we don't know the exact date. But that, that'll be good to actually explore Ashington. I've never been there, but I'm sure it's a nice place because it's in Northumberland. Northumberland's beautiful. All right, boss showed up. Let's go to Pegswood. Once again, we're having to just pay attention to the maps here to make sure we're actually going to the right spot. Get off at the right stop. Thank you. All right, Pegswood Railway Station bus stop. Not a confusing name at all, uh, but it's just on this bridge right here. Not that the, the station is on the bridge, I mean, the bridge is where the entrance is. Yeah, or rather the station is below the bridge, the entrance is on the bridge. That's a very old looking sign. Looks like it might be from like Arriva Northern, N not Arriva Rail North, like the one from the previous Arriva from like 2003 or something. This also appears to be another one of those stations where the platforms are so low they've got little extra bits that are raised up to sort of lessen the uh, step up onto the train. Good design. Any accessibility is good accessibility. I am quite glad we waited until late spring to do this because if we'd done this earlier on in the year because um, it's actually 6 p.m. right now at the time we're filming and uh, yeah earlier on in the year it would have already been dark by now and this entire video would have been filmed in the dark so yeah I'm glad I'm getting to see this all in the daylight which is quite nice. 
I actually genuinely forgot we were on the East Coast mainline. I was like, <laughs> looking at, you know, this, this, this typical, you know, just generic northern station, but oh no, there's LNER and everything coming through because we're on the East Coast mainline. This feels weird. <laughs> this doesn't feel right. I feel like normally you tend to associate these stations with almost no trains at all. Well, this one being two trains a day, one in the morning, one in the evening. I tend to associate them with being like really run down or just in the middle of nowhere, but this station actually seems still fairly well maintained and is in the middle of a fairly large village. Like, it's not bad, but yeah, it, it's, it's weird. It feels very strange. So our first train out of here, well, first train from a station that's one of the three core. Cool. Anyway, uh, yeah, it's going to arrive in a couple of minutes from now and we're going to take it to Acklington. All right, one of three done. Pegswood. So, next stop. Acklington. Acklington. So it should only be something like 13 minutes to Acklington, because uh, we go through Widrington as well. We come back to Widrington later from Acklington. Ah, uh, yes. We may not be exactly doing <laughs> this, but you, you, you have decided to uh, rock the uh, the lovely point-to-point -point merch yeah, today. I mean, it's very comfortable, actually. I don't have that many uh, yeah. t-shirts on. I was like, you know what? I like it. Yeah. I'll put it on. <laughs> Nats.art. <laughs> Why does the announcer pronounce it as Acklington? Like, like with emphasis on the ling. Acklington. Oh, well, I won't judge. Acklington. All right, here's Acklington. Number two of three. Now, I would stay for a minute to admire the station, but we can't really dawdle here. This is kind of the riskiest part of the plan. We've got um, about 30 minutes to do a 23-minute walk to a bus stop at the other side of Acklington Village. So, uh, yeah, we should probably get there in good time. So the last time I did this walk was in November when I last came here and did this and it was pitch black and as you can see there's no street lights so yeah it was not fun. Acklington is such a tiny little pretty village. It's always a wonderful surprise when I run into things like this. So our uh, bus stop we need should just be at this uh, road intersection right here and that down there looks it's not focusing there we are looks to be it cool well this is nice they've uh, provided a nice little bench here for this bus stop definitely a lovely place for a bench yeah it's very quiet all you can really hear is just birds <laughs> and the occasional car the occasional car that passes by but you know still not a bad bus stop this <laughs> I'd rate it a solid eight. Well, it's the uh, bus's due time now, so should hopefully be arriving any second now. Look at us with the, uh, the cool kids at the back of the bus again. All right, so off to Widrington. So we saw there was a charter train between Edinburgh and Derby like basically due to pass Widrington Station two minutes after our bus was meant to get there. Our bus is three minutes late, so I doubt we're gonna see it, but it would have been nice. Although the charter train is currently one minute late, so it, it, I really hope we catch it, but look, it's not looking likely. The, uh, the rear seats on these buses here are sort of, albeit unintentionally, heated seats thanks to the, the engine under here. All right, I think we're on the last stretch before our stop, so uh, if you could do the honours. Nice. Do you think we might make it in time? I actually do think we might to make see the it to see the charter. Oh my god. <laughs> that, would be... that would be very nice if we could. All right, we've made it, and the level crossing is down. That's a good sign. Am I, once again, for like the fifth time this month, going to accidentally see a charter train? <laughs> nice. Oh, oh I'm my so God. happy we got that. Oh. We literally... Hopefully your photos were nice. <laughs> uh, probably not, but it's, it's not the photos that count. So, it's the friends we made along the way. <laughs>
Anyway, so currently it is about half seven, uh, as sort of when we're here, and we still have half an hour to wait for the train, so... Uh, yeah, not much we can do, but apart from just wait. <laughs> Ah, let's, uh, let's get into the waiting shelter, shall we? Oh my god, I can face through glass, no way. <laughs> Quite clearly this, uh, pane must have been smashed or something, because there's a couple bits of broken glass on the floor here. And a suspicious missing pane of glass. Now, whilst we are at Widrington and we have been to all three stations now, we're not quite complete yet, as by my definition anyway, to actually visit a station you have to either board or alight a train at it. So we are going to have to wait for the train to show up and then we can get on it and get out of Woodrington and then that officially counts. So CCTV is in operation due to recent events. What goes on here to need that? Oh god. Well, I guess that, for starters, should have been obvious. Well, that's it. We've now officially done the three stations we intended. <laughs> yeah. Cool. That, that, not what I was saying. We, we did it. Cool. Nice. So, welcome to this instalment of what we're calling, uh, for legal reasons, the Snackers uh, Shack. Uh, so, uh, today's guest is Nat. So, for my Tesco meal deal, I got some Tesco sushi, which actually, for some reason, the Tesco own brand sushi is gluten free. So, I mean, that's like the only meal deal thing I can have. Got some chicken satay skewers and a Dr. Pepper. <laughs> nice. It's been pleasant to see the uh, stations along this line in the actual daylight for the first ever time. I've, I've genuinely never seen them in daylight, even in like video. I've never. So that, that's pleasant. Very nice. So uh, with all that done, I guess uh, it's back off to Newcastle. Reported to our team. Well, we're at Newcastle. We did it, finally. Oh, hi Jamie, how are you doing? <laughs> Hello. <laughs> so yeah, Acklington, Woodrington and Pegswood. I actually made it to the line for once, that's very nice. So did I. <laughs> yeah, totally. Yeah, Jamie, you... Jamie was here the whole time. Well, yeah. Just <laughs> invisible, you know, yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> anyway, yeah, so I hope you enjoyed and I uh, will see you in the next video. Goodbye. Bye. And of course, a massive shout out to all of my patrons and channel members who are listed on screen now. Thank you all for supporting the channel.